Canons, or rounds in music, are when different people are playing the same thing, but someone starts a bit later. That's a kind of transformation, and we can write more complicated canons by doing other transformations on the music. Here's a basic round, row, row, row your boat, where everyone sings the same thing, but some people start a bit later. Row, row, row your boat, gently row, down row, the stream. Row your boat, gently merrily, down the merrily, stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a merrily, dream. Merrily, life is but a dream. I can draw a graph of row, row, row your boat. So this graph says that at time one, I go row, and then at time two, I go row, and then at time three, I keep going and so on. Now, the next person is going to start four measures later. That means that the second person is going to start at time five. If I call the first person F and the second person G, I see that at time five, G is going to do what F did at time one. So G at time five equals F at time one. And then G at time six equals F at time two, and G at time seven equals F at time three, and so on. So that means that G at time t is always doing what F did at time t minus four. Row, row, row your boat, gently row, down row, the stream. Row your boat, gently merrily, down merrily, the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a merrily, dream. Merrily, life is but a dream. That's called a translation because we've shifted everything sideways without moving it in any other direction. Let's try another transformation. Let's try making it go backwards. This is called a crab cannon. Here's how a crab cannon sounds on row, row, row your boat. Row, row, row your boat, gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. That did not sound that great. Another transformation we could try is a rotation. Here, I have the music for row, row, row your boat written out twice, and I'm going to rotate one of them and play them both at the same time. Let's see how that sounds. did not sound that great. But there is a mirror canon that was attributed to Mozart, although we don't think it's by Mozart anymore, which really does sound all right. And you can play it with one person standing on each side of the same sheet of music. Just because you use math to write pieces of music does not guarantee it's going to sound good at all. So when composers do use math and also it sounds good, something much more than math has happened. <laughs>